religion is still a part of our life. Without a doubt, religion is a part of the history of Europe. Uh, if you consist in the struggle with religious symbols, you have to demolish all churches. That is uh, what they plan to, to do during the French Revolution. But the example of French Revolution shows that when someone forcibly expels one religion, then in its place usually appears some other teaching. And this teaching is not necessarily better or more tolerant. I consider religiously motivated intolerance in public to be unacceptable. However, I also consider unacceptable any intolerance towards religious people and symbols that play a considerable role for them. Of course, there are special cases when the requirements must be stricter, for example, schools or offices of public administration. However, even uh, there, the main question is, are religious symbols lead to indoctrination? There was an interesting case at the European Court of Human Rights, which concerned crucifixes hung in Italian schools. The court did not consider them to be a violation of human rights because it was a tradition rather than anything else. Thanks to this decision uh, of the court of Strasbourg, uh, we shall not give up the official symbols of many European countries. Let us remember how many flags and state emblems contain crosses, images of saints, etc. To my mind, the question of religious symbols can be reduced to our understanding of the pluralism of opinions and ideas. If pluralism is ensured, then the ban can, be, can only be harmful.